Aloha, you guys. So, I'm going to have to stop saying aloha, maybe. Um, here's the deal. We were living in Maui for the last nine years, and we loved everything about it. And we're so, so glad that we made that decision to move there. When we moved there, we thought if we moved there for one year, we thought it was just one year, that... Um, it would be worth it and so we went and we ended up staying for nine and we made amazing friends we had amazing jobs um, we lived in two amazing apartments um, there's a lot about apartments and the reason why we decided to leave so somebody bought the home that we were living in and the people who bought the home decided that they didn't want anybody living in there or they were going to do some renovations or something. And when we went to go look for apartments, the apartments were double um, what we were paying previously. Um, and so we looked into what our options were. We thought we would just stay and rent but then that was really expensive and felt like it was almost the same price as buying a home. So we looked at buying, but unfortunately with what we could afford, we could only buy a like 300 square foot studio apartment, condo. Um, and then we started talking about what we were doing. River whale. <laughs> um, then we started talking about what we were doing and a lot of things came up. Our parents are getting older, you know, we want to start traveling and um, as we get older, we need to start thinking of our own health and our own situation and retirement and all that, all that stuff. Um, so long story short, we made the decision to move back to Minnesota. Um, Jonah and his mom own this boathouse that we're living on and it's super cute it's like a tiny home it's probably not that much bigger than our other apartment um, but we have a beautiful little outdoor patio to sit on um, we do have some neighbors but um, the neighbors on this side are almost never there and the neighbors on this side is just a boat dock so um so yeah we are living on a boathouse in minnesota on the mississippi river and it's kind of an interesting little thing because there's only a hundred i think it's 101 or 102 boathouses on the mississippi in minnesota that you're allowed to live on um full time and we have one of those so it's kind of a special thing and it's nice i told joan i said if we have to go from living walking distance to the ocean i want to live in the boathouse and make it work and figure it out there's a lot of work to be done there's no running water um, there is electricity and internet slow internet but internet and so we have we have what we need, um, but we want to get a bathroom of some sort, um, a shower, a toilet. Um, but I'll show you guys some of what we're doing to deal with our kitchen water right now and like, you know, what we're doing for bathroom. I'm sure I showed you guys a little bit about walking up to the porta potty. We're using that right now. It's summer. It's not that big of a deal. Um, and then we have a little kitchen area set up. If we need to shower, we just go to Jonah's mom's house to shower for right now, or my mom's house. Um, same thing for laundry. And we'll probably be doing that through the winter, but we will be making plans through the winter to figure out the bathroom situation um, if we don't figure it out before then. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick little update. I know it's not really quick. I've been talking for like five minutes, um, but this is kind of what's going on. If you guys have any questions about what we're doing, um, whatever, leave them down in the comments below. Um, I will try to get some more videos out and keep you guys posted. Uh, I'm working on a few different things right now. Um, but I will have some stuff coming for you guys very soon. Uh, I'll talk to you soon. Okay, much aloha. Uh, I'll see you guys later.
Bye. Good morning, you guys. I'm kind of in a stopping point with my videos because the next set of videos that's supposed to come out is our wedding videos. But there's a lot of footage that I still need to gather and a lot of things that I want to do with that. And it's put me at a point where I'm like, mm, what do I do? Like if, if I keep waiting for everything and I don't work on it, it's going to be forever until I get new videos out. Everybody who's very excited about the wedding videos, I promise, I promise, I promise, they're coming. But until then, I hope you guys enjoy the next set of videos and um, enjoy the new location. I've been really enjoying living on the boathouse. There's going to be a lot more to come. I'm going to be having some videos with some before and after pictures. I hope you guys enjoy um, all the adventures that were left on Maui until we left try to put together some things that kind of make a cohesive story um, for my memories but also for you guys to enjoy uh, yeah <laughs> I will talk to you guys soon